Right, what's up everyone? Welcome back to more FIFA 20 career mode. Hope you're doing well out there in the world as this current epidemic, pandemic, whatever you want to call it, continues. So, today's game is Valencia versus Barcelona and we are away and it is the final of the Copa de España. So hopefully, at the end of the game, we can pick up the trophy. We've been doing really well since our departure from the Europa League against Sporting. We haven't lost a game yet, so our winning streak is still going. So hopefully we can continue that in this game. So we're about to find out what happens. We're going to jump right in. So without further ado, I hope you enjoy this, and here we go. When the journey begins, you never quite know who's going to be there at the end. Now only two teams left in the cup, and we're left wondering who's going to be lifting it. Stay with us, we'll have all the action for you live right here on EA TV. Well, after plenty of pre-match anticipation, the wait is finally over. My name is Derek Ray. I'm joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary box. And we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a spectacular final. It's Valencia versus Barcelona. Well, all the hard work to get to a cup final. Don't disappoint yourself. Don't disappoint those fans. Go out and make it yours. Make that cup something you're really proud to win. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow. Lee, what do you think we'll see from him? Well, four goals in his last three games is in superb form. It's going to be really hard to stop. The defenders need to be on their game. And here's the initial 11 for Valencia. Jasper Simerson begins the game between the firsts. Gabriel Paulista plays with Ezequiel Garay in central defence. Danny Parejo starts alongside Jeffrey Condovia in central midfield. And Andre Kramaric plays together with Kevin Guevara. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Marc-Andre Ter Stegen starts in goal. Milan Skriniar plays alongside Clément Langlais in the centre of defence. Arthur plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And the defenders had better be on their toes because leading the line is Luis Suarez. Okay, it's kickoff time. The game is underway. Racing, All right, let's Valencia see if we can get the result we need here. in order to pick up this trophy. Good start. Griezmann gets himself into the attacking third with the ball at his feet. Oh, Messi Excellent just went to move to shift on to his left foot. Not giving him a moment's peace. He lost it. Parejo and Kramaric on the ball. From Dombia. Nice. Nice oh, pass. Oh no, it didn't no work. Oh, got it back. No, lost it again. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. De Jong. Messi. Artur. Speculative effort here. Oh, unlucky Messi. Dombia. He got back there relatively quick. Andre Kramaric. Had space for the shot, the and all of a sudden he's right in front of me, blocking me out of it. Gets. Well done, keeper. Well keeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. That girl cracking there. She looked like she got that face gets. on her. Like, Why am I here? Well, he has been ruled off I'm so bored. Here. Can't have been by an awful lot. Oh, I'm not so sure, but the linesman's got a better view than I have. Yeah. 
Kimmich with it. Oh, Messi made the run that bad. He's just walked in and grabbed it off me. Stood there for too long. Andre Kramaric, Parejo. So hard to overcome Jordi Alba. Messi. Suarez. Suarez. Passing it around with a Oh, ball. went for the shot again. Now, what can they do from here? Suarez! Oh! Well kept out. Oh, sorry, the it... corner. No, I thought they were... the way he moved there, Suarez, the way he reacted. I thought he was caught offside. And firing it into the area. Frankie de Jong, Suarez, oh. wide of the target, and he's going to be disappointed. Disappointed, wow, it's a shocker. He should be doing a lot, lot better than that. To go Can't give away the ball in the box like that. The danger clear. Now Parejo. Kramaric. And he'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. Here is Vass. And Torres on the ball. Now Busquets. Sergio Busquets has lost it. Strength and control, a big part of his game. Excellent defending. Messi, Barcelona have lost possession. Don't know what Messi was doing there. Oh, he's given the ball away. Oh! Power there, but just too much elevation on the Busquets. short lead. Yeah, over the bar, Derek, with pace. He's a little unlucky. He's been known for scoring better goals than that. If you look on YouTube, some of the goals he's scored are absolutely just mad. The guy is well talented, but you don't see him do much. That's a problem. Messi. Suarez. Griezmann. Suarez. Top notch tackle. Barcelona have been awarded the throw in. Suarez, Sergio Busquets, a very good tackle. That blocking ridiculous, twice had the chance here, and stopped me every time. Apply the pressure. Vas, racing forward, trying to catch them out. The ball with Condompia. No, don't let the go. A really sumptuous ball. Oh, and for God's goal. sake. Pressure on the opposition. Look at well, that. He didn't even take the shot on one of one of the keepers. Played it again, squared it off, and then he tapped it in. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? Oh, where was the defence? The match has restarted. 1 0 here. Messi. Possession lost, intercepted. Gonzalo Getch in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Not again. Oh, for fuck off! What is going on here? And the lead fully merited. I've got it on defensive. There should be more players well, Gary, around there stopping it. Tell you to stop the cross from coming in, but they didn't get tight enough. Are all just for sitting it. back behind? They're miles behind. Such a letdown when so the team plays now. like that. And plenty.
plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. Andrei Kramaric. Gabriel. He's given it straight to the opposition. Busquets. Opportunity it is. Yes, we're back in. Only one goal behind now. Suarez. Got back into that relatively quickly. Nice little blue ball. Good angle. Great shot. Nice. So there we have it. 2 1. Interception. Otto has it. No, just lost out on that. Andre Kramaric. Gamero. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Well, it might still work out for them. That was worrying. Otto. Now Busquets. Nice, Luis nice ball. Pass here. Griezmann. Was a very fine oh, read. Got stopped. Good pass. With the a good position. Busquets. Suarez. On the ball, Luis Suarez. Terrific oh, ball there. God. He's feeling the pressure here. Double cross. And options in the centre. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Well, on the volley, that's not how he had planned it in his mind. No, he certainly saw the ball going in a different direction than it went in. Yes, man. Now Busquets. Messi. Suarez. Oh, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. Oh, lovely way to We're playing well enough to get right back in the game again, yeah, but just not pulling off the end, end of it. Oh, for fuck's sake! Really? What bullshit is this? Here, yeah, you've done it with another team now. Well, we First of all, start with Tottenham, couldn't beat them in the Champions League or whatever at all, they were just really entirely dominant, overpowered and ridiculous. The then we had Sporting in the Europa, we've gone out to Sporting in the Europa, because they were just well, ridiculously hard to beat again. And then, now, look what they've done with Valencia. Now, why is it that they developed these teams to be like this? It doesn't make the game any fun at all sure when you get yourself back match. in the game and you have to start again and try and get more back because the goal number is just totally ridiculous it's going to be. I don't like it when developers make teams overpowered like this Jose Angel. Really good Valencia possession stats, and all of their team are enjoying this performance. That's why they're winning, and that's why they're one of the best teams. Jordi Alba. Great defending from Busquets. Messi. On the ball, Luis Suarez. And very deftly cut again. Sergio Busquets. Suarez. Messi. And Messi's incisive pass. Simple save oh. for the keeper. Well, he had to pick the fly to the ball up. That was all. Got behind it. Good save. And that's an important intervention. Look at this, the ridiculous one-touch passing. Well kept out. 
just pushing the ball through every space they can. Look at that. This is what annoys me about this. I've had it with, as I said, Tottenham and, and Sporting. Two teams that I should shorts. have beat and just cannot do it. Because the AI is just eight. over the top. And it's this as well. That was nearly four. Now with Gabriel Paulista. Read it superbly to take back possession. Well, they are on the wrong end of the scoreline. But Lee, your overall thoughts on their current situation? Well, so far I'd give Barcelona just 6 out of 10. They've been the nearly team. It's so close. Be a bit more aggressive in midfield. Get the ball into wide areas a little bit more. Try and stretch the opposition. No, sir. And no problems whatsoever. Oh, he's given the oh, ball Oh, come away. on! Giving the ball away one moment and then making a fine save the next. Yeah, we all make mistakes, don't we, Derek? On that occasion, it was the goalkeeper, but he made up for it. Come on, that one well, touch he and wants again! To hang on to the ball, which he did. Now, Johnny Alba. And now, passing. Brilliant ball. Griezmann. Lionel Messi is positioned at the back. Nobody post. there. All cut out again. And Torres on the ball. Daniel Vass. And Kramaric on the ball. Look at this one touch Condopia. into all the positions Michael available. Okay. Again, again, again and again and again. Couldn't hang on to it. Why do they have to make teams like this? And Kevin Gamero prepared to fire. And the managers will now deliver their half time team. Right, 6.3. Great vision of the through ball pass. Short passes are top notch. Good to see so much positivity from passes. Always looking for opportunities to get the ball forward. Quality one touch passing. Okay. We haven't done as much as Valencia have, but. There's still time to get back in it. Let's see what the second half has to offer. And Barcelona kick off. Well, we should be in for appetising second half fair. Barcelona get the half going. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponents. And that was a very fine read. Suarez, Messi, Griezmann, and stopped well, again. Read there to intercept. The Look at this one to touch. Here. It's all happening again. Just one touching all the time. Arthur has it. Messi. Barca making progress. And I make Only a move with the position. ball and I get dispossessed. Now we're back now. to the one touch again. Ball over the top. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. It might seem like I'm moaning, but there's so much of this messy. As I've said, overpowered team stuff going on. on EA TV. It's, it's so annoying. Villarreal. Yeah, I'm predicting a crap. Straight at the keeper, no real difficulties for him. No, decent position from the goalkeeper. Poor shot, to be honest with you. More action from La Liga coming up for you live here on EA TV. It's Barcelona versus Celta Vigo. Yeah, the fix is coming thick and fast. Should be a good game, that. Oh, hopefully that's not the commentator's curse. And dispossessed. What well up, Messi? Run it See, I turned on the player there, dispossessed again. Now watch Valencia. One touch, one touch, Your one touch. Under no real pressure. See what I mean? Everything they do is one touch. One touch to, to the, the positions that they want to get to. Look, one touch, one touch. Of running We're out in the wing the now. Position. It'll be a one touch again, even though I've blocked it. You can What's happened now? It most certainly was. Free kick given. Messi's off. Then Benny's on. Substitution. It's going to be another substitution as well, and a free kick for no reason. 
to Valencia. And fire from the flank into the area. And a half-baked clearance. A wonderful intervention. Now Griezmann. Griezmann. One again. Now we're back to one touch. Torres on the ball. Superbly read and executed. I'm sorry to keep going on about it, but I just want you to see how ridiculous Excellent this game is. Look, straight down, if he wasn't offside, offside that would have been time. one great pass over to well, the box. Been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. The, I don't know Jordi Alba. Why, why it happens, I really don't. Griezmann. Suarez. Now Griezmann. Suarez. Artur. And it might be, and in by... Well, that's it. That's the second goal. We're only one goal behind now. We've got to fight Here's back Luka. against See all this sheer ridiculousness goal, of all out. this Valencia. One pass, one touch, well, one pass, again, one touch, into angle. the box. Players everywhere. I'm going to try and cancel all that out, but this is just stupid. Absolutely stupid. Right, Dembele's put us one goal behind, so that's fine. We've got one to catch up on now. Well, neutrals are getting their money's worth. 3 2 in this match. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. Look, there we, look at this. Might have potential. Electing to cross into the centre. Well, it was pretty straightforward for the goalkeeper. Oh, oh that would away. have been great if that through ball come on. So a throw in here. Sergio Busquets. Now Griezmann. Possession That's good ball. Hands. The pass the back is terrible. There. Moving into the advanced position. Here we go. Look at this. And they convert. Magnificent from Mark and Peter Stegen. They're doing it again. Poor execution with regard to the corner. Mike, can he take advantage? And the keeper is taking care of the situation. Now Busquets. Artur. Griezmann. Good use of the ball, but can they trouble the defence? And that was a very oh, good read. On the turn, that was right in the box. That was a great for an attack. Given away. Jose Angel. Gonzalo Gensch now. Here we go, look. Swift Here we go again. Goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. Good ball to Griezmann. Dembele on the ball. Moving the ball up. It's a weighted pass. Oh! away from the target, Lee. No, it was decent. Really, really decent chance for the lad. They'll keep pushing away to try and get that equaliser. So close. to the final 20 minutes here. Look at that. Now, I mean, they do it from here? And everyone in the come on. Are looking on as it sailed over them. I like a challenge, but this is this is taking the piss. Artur has it. Dembele. Artur. Straight down the throat of the opposition. Well cleared away. Artur has it. So far, Griezmann seems the best bet Griezmann. on that side. Attending to his defensive chores. From 
one side of the pitch to the other. They might be going to wait for, for the counter attack, you know. Well, they can't quite take advantage in the end. To light oh! Pass. Oh! He's in Come on! Griezmann on that left hand side was the best option we had. I've said it all along. Against that one touch passing that they've all been doing for the whole entire game, Griezmann was the best option on that left hand side of the pitch to get us back in. And he's done it. And if you enjoy high scoring contests, Oh, man. come on, we've got to do this now. I've had me rage. I've had me moan of this one-touch passing bullshit, but we've got to get the game now. We've got to get it. And what was that? Oh, the one last option of passing we had, it was terrible. Right, chase it. That's it, give it back. The ball with Condompia. That's it, keep the ball, that's fine. Keeper would expect to catch that one. Oh, that's lovely. Now Griezmann. That's well, bad, though. It's just that last part. If we can get that down, we can win this. With it. But not like this. No! Cancel it! God! Relentless high pressing. The referee has given the advantage to Barca. Slip short passing. It's with Parejo. Right, cancel him out. No, don't leave him in. You've got players coming. Oh, thank God. Nice high ball. Could be a chance to break here. I don't know how we lost that. He might be able to profit from the wide position. Come on. And there's the feed into the box. Oh, thank God he missed it. A wonderful scoring opportunity, but offside by a whisker. Well, we often criticise the officials, but he got that spot on. Parejo. Don't start all this now. So get right back into it and have a free goal against us or so stupid like that. Far from a good pass. Being pressed and pressed high. Dembele. No! It's going to go extra time. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They Unless it goes straight to pens. Targets available, cross comes in. Attending to his defensive chores. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. Well, it was never going to worry the keeper. Come on. Oh, no wonder he's looking a little bit sheepishly at his teammates. Head in a hand sort of moment. Gabriel. Coquelin. Jose Angel. Contopia. On to Getch. No. Oh, thank God. This could be the last throw. Now he must favour the cross. He's very adept at protecting the ball. Wide of the target and he's going to be disappointed. Disappointed. Wow, it's a shocker. He should be doing a lot, lot better than that. 
Parejo. That's it. Is that after 90 minutes? They are level and extra time is coming up. It is extra time. Okay. At full time, Valencia 3, Barcelona 3. Right, he must secure short passes, 16.5. Great vision with the three balls. Short passes are top notch. Good to see much positivity. Always looking for an opportunity to get the ball forward. Okay, we fought back from all this mess that was the one touch bollocks in the first half and the second half. So now we're looking for the win to save us going into penalties. Let's see what happens. And right, the drama Valencia continues. Kick -off. We're now into the first period of extra time tonight, mate. First uh, half, this 30 extra minutes time. now is going to separate the weak ones from the strong ones. Let's see who wins. Gabriel in position here to protect the ball. Tremendous intuition to win it back. That's nice bad pass. Very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. Beautifully weighted ball. Well, he's just got to continue his run. No! Well, I don't believe it. Them. Well, he stopped it out of there without much fuss. And options in the centre. Oh, that was a stupid well, effort. I thought at least he would have gone well, for a bicycle a kick or a volley or something. And he got the timing completely wrong there. What was your idea of that silly header? Artur. Dembele. Griezmann. Oh, Griezmann's cut out. Gonzalo Kedge. Oh, total interception. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Jose Angel. It's with Parejo. Andre Kramaric might be able to produce from this position. And can he deliver accurately? And a good take under duress well, there. Mistaken did well there. What was that forward pass? It's supposed to go out to the right. Oh, just bugging it right up for us. I'll kick it. Jose Angel. Gonzalo Gibbs now. It's a perfect challenge. And Dembele couldn't keep the ball. Rupal went nowhere. He might be able to profit from the wide position. That's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. Coquelin. Now Parejo. Jose Angel. Come to me out! Oh! With the volley. Well, to catch it like that, you've got a really good technique. And oh, so close. Condombia, Gabriel, Parejo, no, Gets. Gets. oh, Gets. great save, great save to Stegen, well done. As he stretched for that. Corner kick played in, what a vital intervention. Just a bit too high with that powerful effort. Just lean back, Derek. Power was there, but not the direction. I don't know what on earth I was doing there. I was trying to lob pass it. But... The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Wasteful again in possession. He stuck his foot out there to block that. Pass. 
And the ball's nice gone. Nice one. Unlucky. Right. That's the end of the first half. Extra time. Still no change. Valencia 3, Barcelona 3. Right, Barcelona pick up the second half of extra it's time. It's the second period of extra time underway now. Griezmann can always collect those balls. They're so well. They can see them forge ahead. Dembele. Well, he made that interception. Oh, that's so routine. close. If he'd have moved across him after collecting the ball, I would have had a great a shot vision. on goal. Just drifted into the illegal position, offside, in the opinion of the officials. Kimi. And you've got to try to make it a bit more difficult for your opponent than that. Goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. Oh, out for throw. Barcelona have been awarded the throw in. It's another throw one. Given. No. It's with Garay. Garay. Now Cochera. Ezekiel Garay on top via. Well defended. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be. I'm really not kick. looking forward to penalties. I need a goal just to secure it and just hold off to the end. Now with Gabriel Paulista. It's with Parejo. Not a very complicated catch for the keeper. Looks promising this. And no. forward. And that's fine. Great Good save. Real concentration. To Stegen's really helping us out here. Let's see. Nice contribution, but what next? Oh, come on, ref. I got the ball. I had a clear advantage. I'm pretty sure the goalkeeper wasn't as well. It was close. Parejo. It's with Ruben Sobrino. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. No, give it away. Now with Gabriel Paulista. Give it away again. Parejo, not really the ideal clearance. It's with Garay. Now Cochrane. Read it magnificently and intercepted. They don't normally need a second invitation to give it a go on the counter. Oh, like open road for them, but up a dead end. That was almost there. For Griezmann. Good technique displayed. Well, great read there to intercept. And in oh, this could be it. Go on, Antoine. Deflection. Oh, that should be a call now. Well, listen, he's tried to no? hit it too hard. Just relax a little bit. Unbelievable. Focus on your technique. I thought at least that was a deflection. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Oh, come on, ref. You don't even give that as a foul. When I tackled earlier, you called a foul for me. Poor pass under no real pressure. No, I wanted that through the middle. Griezmann's calling for it. And a goal at this stage might work. This could wrap it up. On the goal, oh, brilliant save. It's going to go to pins. Oh, don't want penalties.
penalties. It's going to be pens. And this will test the mentality of any footballer. And he's ducked his first goal in. Lee. Well, he held his nerve. Simple as that. And up he comes, doing his best to remain focused. And it's gone in. Brilliant. Well, the sweet sound he scored as well. Right, which way is he going? I'm going to go left. To from the spot. And yes! I guessed it correctly. Strong hands as a goalkeeper, and look at that. And the yes, and we scored the second. Here. Well, that's hours of practice. Right, I'm going to go to the right. Can he get the better of the keep? And he's denied the what? spot. Oh, oh did I save it? He really is. And off the Plus bar. Oh, bollocks. Well, Left. And he Saved! Oh, come on! And won. Well, oh, I don't know how I'm guessing. I'm just... Oh, well, I don't know. And now yes! We've got the trophy. We've got it. Oh, we went all the way. And finally, it's proved fruitful. And we've got the Copa de España. We're bringing it home. We're bringing it home to the new camp. 3-3, went all the way, we won 3-1 on penalties. Right. Yes, you're in I'm going to go and celebrate, and I'll leave you to watch the, time to go to the opposition handing and of the trophy unlucky. and all the celebrations that come with it. So, enjoy. It's going to be quite the night of celebration here. Well, it's these moments, Derek, when you get your hands on the silverware, and that little medal that goes round your neck might seem small now, but you look back at that, show your grandkids absolutely superb memories these players will have of this game it's a special moment in the career of any footballer and now for the trophy lift itself the cup winners yeah it's been a long old road to get to this point they're going to celebrate now and certainly celebrate long into the night i think there's always the element of chance at a cup competition but my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. And this is really special. Getting to celebrate in front of your own fans. Well, it's giving something back. These fans have travelled all over the place following their team. Now they get to join in the celebrations, go into the crowd and give them the cup. That's what I say. Well, then it might never find its way to the trophy cabinet, Lee. this tournament all comes together at the end when you pick the trophy up just look at them celebrating a brilliant moment hard work indeed Lee the trophy now in their possession Ramare. Right, there you go. The Copa de España comes home to the new Camp. Barcelona 3, Valencia 3 at full time and at extra time. And we won 3-1 on penalties. So, our winning streak is still going strong. Right, who we got next? We have Celta Vigo in the league. So where are we? We're... 
64. 12 behind Atletico and 13 behind Real. Still sitting at the top. Okay, that's where we're going to leave it. I hope you enjoyed that video. We finally kicked up and we won the Copa de España. And now we're concentrating on the league. We've got no European Championship dreams. We've got no Europa League dreams. So all we've got now is whatever we're left in tournament wise and the league so let's keep this going on a good note and hopefully we can pick up three points away to sell to Vigo in the next video as well so hope you enjoyed what you've seen so far if you have leave a like and a comment let me know what you think don't forget to subscribe if you're new help support the channel thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video bye bye for now